There was consolidation in the Linux OS sector yesterday as Nokia and Intel announced that they would merge their open source operating systems. Nokia's MIMO and Intel's Mobilin will become MIGO as Nokia continues its fight against encroaching market share from Apple and Google. Telecom TV's Leila Mackey spoke to Nokia's Thomas Jonsson. Android is a competitor. We have many competitors. Android is one of them. Uh, I think the unique thing that we have with Migo today is that it's going to be a truly open platform that's going to be hosted by the Linux Foundation, so it's really open and the whole developer can communicate, can come together and develop it further. So that's really a differentiator for us. We can see today that the mobile is becoming truly a computer and this is a giant step forward in making the mobile more computer-like and actually becoming, if you want, the computer of the future. And I think that's a development that has started and Migo will give that development a great push forward. Nokia and Intel said the Migo platform will scale up to larger devices such as PCs, in-car systems and tablets. We will, by, by using Migo, be able to go from mobile over to small netbooks and, and use it in a range of different devices, also in the home. So that's a great thing, actually, that expands across devices, which will also increase the connectivity between different types of devices. And Nokia's first Migo device is scheduled for the second half of 2010.